Hello Sagittarius, it's my lady from Malay's Way Terry and I'm coming to do your weekly weekend reading for the weekend of August 11, 2017. The cards I'm using today are Oceanic Tarot Cards by Jane Wallace. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. If you want one, description box below. Um, make sure to check out some Moon and Rising signs and let's get this show on the road. Alright, what's going on? Okay. So uh, this makes me feel like, wow, my God, fire is on fire. There's a, every, a conflict in, in the Aries, definitely. Um, but is, somebody is not happy about, I'm feeling like either a business venture that somebody cares about not starting. Maybe somebody um, was, said they was pregnant and they weren't or something like that. But somebody is, is arguments going on about those situations. Or like anything, like, got to do the, with the start of something new. Yeah, okay. Or somebody, I'm hearing car. So somebody, like, said they're going to uh, help you get your car fixed or pay for your car, but they didn't. But let's keep going. Let's go on. All right, what is this? Triangle. So it might be a new love interest or it might be a bunch of celebrations going on. Let's see. All right, what's going on for Sagittarius for the weekend of... August 11, 2017. What is this? Reflection. So, yeah, it's a whole lot of denial going on this weekend. Some people just not trying to look at things for what they are. Mm -mm -mm. All right. All right, completion. So, I feel like some of you feel like just a love situation is complete. Maybe you have all you need in a, a relationship, but let's keep going. Oh, yeah, this is good. So, basically, somebody's happy. Somebody's complete. Somebody feel like they got all they, they need in a love situation. Oh. So, somebody looks like somebody is going back to their ex to get what they want, but remember, it's in retrograde, so... I mean, not for everybody, but it might not last that long, you know? All right, so. Okay, it looks like either a money offer was turned down or your ex might be coming back for money or you for them. General reading, it could be for either way, but you are head over heels right now. All right, so. Yeah, you don't care about, like, the money. You don't care about them use, using you, or you don't think they're using you. You don't care. You know, you spend the money. It's just like whatever. You just want to spend time with this person because you love them. You're like, you, I'm not even thinking about this no more. This is what I want. Ooh, yeah, but this person, you need to watch them. I mean, I know you head over heels for this ex, but look at this. You see these bottom cards? You got the uh, page of wands reversed. No, Page of Pentacles, sorry. Reverse. You got the Hermit Reverse, which is sort of a good card to me. But you got the, the King of Swords Reverse. So you got somebody who's looking to use you. You just head over heels. But this person knows what they want. But this person is a lying deceiver, okay? All right, what's at the bottom of the deck for the Sagittarius? All right. So, competition. Yeah, um... Yeah, I think they might have left somebody else to come to you or, you know, maybe y'all just both ended up single this time, you know, so you feel like it's good this time around, but this one is no good. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure you check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal read, check in the description box below. Other than that, have some fun.